and welcome to the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I'm sure you're keen to get into that hot seat, so let's get started. OK, let's take a quick check on the rules. Up to four of you can play the game and each of you will need to choose adult or junior questions. Then, for the first time ever, you'll be able to choose the type of questions you'd like to answer. There are three categories. General knowledge, entertainment and sport. Simply choose one and stick with it. All you need to do then is answer the 15 questions that stand between you and a virtual one million pounds. As always, you can walk away at any time and there are the usual three lifelines available to you. Ask the audience, 50-50 and phone a friend. If you make it all the way to a million, you could be jetting off on a luxurious family holiday by entering our competition. So grab your remote control and let's play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Select the difficulty and category of questions you'd like to play. Great, you're having a go at the entertainment questions. Fifteen of them stand between you and a virtual million pounds. The first five of those questions can bank you a guaranteed thousand pounds. Right, here's your first question for one hundred pounds. Good start, that's the right answer. £200 if you can get this right. Very good, that's right. Now, you've not used any lifelines, so they are still all available if you need them on this £300 question. You're right, well done. Question number four is for 500 quid. Uh, you wouldn't want to give me a wrong answer at this stage, would you? And it's a good job you didn't. You got the right answer. You can guarantee yourself £1,000 if you can answer this question. That's the correct answer. Well done. That's what I like to see. Five correct answers and £1,000 safely in the bank. This is where things hot up a little bit, though, as we try and turn that £1,000 into at least 32000 Here comes question number six. Now, remember, you still have all three lifelines remaining. Well done. You just won yourself £2,000. Very well done. You've yet to touch any of your three lifelines and a correct answer here will win you £4,000. Lots of luck. Here comes the question. You've just won £4,000. Well done. Oh, well, I like games like this. You're on £4,000 and you have all three of your lifelines still intact. You are just three questions away from the next milestone. And the first of those questions is worth £8,000 and is coming up now. Are you sure you want to play this question? If this is the correct answer, you'll win £8,000. And it is the correct answer. Well done. OK, things are getting a little bit more serious now. £16,000 is a lot of money. And that's how much you can win by giving me the right answer to question number nine. The drop, if you get this wrong, though, has gone up to 7000 So think carefully before you give me an answer. You had £8,000. You decided to play this question. And you'll be glad you did. It's the right answer. You just won £16,000. 
Well, a magnificent performance from you so far. Nine correct answers, and you've not yet had to use any of your three lifelines. If you can give me a tenth correct answer, you guarantee yourself £32,000. I must remind you, though, at this stage, if you do give me a wrong answer, you drop right back to 1000 Have a look at this question. Take your time. Tell me if you want to play. OK, you want to use your 50-50 lifeline. Computer, can you take away two wrong answers for us, please? You need a bit of help from one of your friends then. No problem. Could be a good move. Pick somebody to help you out. How hard is that? Surely no one you could have rung would know that. I'd use another lifeline if you have any left. Oh dear, if you were banking on that to win you some cash, you'd better think again. Are you sure you want to risk all that money? Has the 50-50 helped you win £32,000? It certainly has. Well played. So, you must be feeling pretty pleased with yourself, and rightly so. 32,000 is now the very least amount you'll be leaving the game with. And we'd love you to turn that into 64,000 pounds. You can do that by giving me the correct answer to this next question. You still have one lifeline available should you need it. Lots of luck, here it comes. Right, here we go then, audience. Best of luck, everybody. We need your help to get this question right. Just choose one of the four available answers on your keypad. If you're all ready, please all vote now. That's quite a tight result. Have enough people gone for C to make you believe it's right? Well, you had £32,000. You now have £64,000. What a performance this is turning out to be. Brilliant. Right, the prize increases really kick in now. The next question is worth £125,000. And believe it or not, you are only four correct answers away from winning one million. You will lose 32,000 if you give me a wrong answer and you've used up all three of your lifelines. It's not often people get to play this question. You could be about to lose 32,000 pounds. Of course, you could be about to win 125,000 pounds. And you have. It's the right answer. Very well played. You could be about to lose £93,000 if you give me the wrong answer to this question. If you give me a correct answer, you'll win a quarter of a million pounds. Now, I would much rather that happened. The very best of luck to you. Let's have a look at question number 13 of a possible 15. Right, this is serious business. You've just decided to play on a question for a quarter of a million pounds. I can tell you. It's the right answer. You are a quarter of a millionaire.
Wow, this is a superb performance. I've just written you out a virtual check for £250,000. Now, hopefully, you can go further. I'm about to ask you a question worth half a million pounds. 500,000. Remember, you have used up all your lifelines, so it would be a serious risk to just guess at this stage, as you would lose £218,000. Have a look at the question. It's number 14 of a possible 15. I must say, I love it when people play these big questions. You had £250,000. You now have £500,000. Fantastic! Right, here we go then. This is your one and perhaps only ever chance to win one million pounds. You have no lifelines left, so you are either going to have to make a complete guess or, of course, you may well just know the answer. I should remind you of the massive amount of money you could lose, but think of what you could win. The best of luck, everybody here is rooting for you. In 1968, the first of these theme parks was built in which country? France, Denmark, Spain, Austria. And I have to check that you are really going to play this question. Is this your final answer? Amazingly, you've decided to play the million pound question. Now, you could have walked away with half a million pounds, but instead, you are walking away with one million pounds. You're a winner. Fantastically well done. Not only have you won a million, you've also got the chance to enter a draw to win a fantastic, all expensive paid family holiday. Just text the winning code for the number on your screen. Very well done, and thanks for playing the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire?